Hello everyone, welcome back to the stream. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time zone it is in your location, based on the Earth's rotation. My name is Bruno Fightmaster. We're back with Pokemon Scarlet and the Mighty Fighty Shushbugs. Last time, uh, we kind of killed it, actually. Uh, we took one of each. Uh, we got a gym under our belt. We got a Starbase and... And we got ourselves a Titan Pokemon. We are doing rather well. Um, yeah, so we took the Steel Titan that was in here. We took out the uh, Poison Starbase that was here in Tag Tree Thicket. And we took out uh, the Kaskarafa Gym. So we are doing pretty good, all things considered. Uh, the thing I did notice um, from our latest gym fight is uh, we got the badge that make Pokemon up to level 40 obey us. Uh, you'll notice that all my guys are pretty close to that 40 mark, which means we probably need to... Uh, speed up the process here a little bit and get some other gems under our belt. So I think that is what we're going to do today. I think we have, because we have four gems left. Uh, we have, uh, uh, let me see. Where is it? Okay, mess goes. All right. So we have the psychic gym over here. Uh, and we have the normal gym here which I believe that these are going to be our next two that would be in line for levels, if memory serves. Um, uh, also, just assuming that anything that's in like a mountainous area normally is kind of the last thing you want to do. So the assumption here is going to be that these two are going to be our next gems. Uh, as far as the Titans are concerned, we have the one out here in the desert, desert the Quaking Earth Titan, which we got the thing for that a while ago um and then we're gonna go to cassie casseroya uh because dragons are nasty uh, and i think for star bases i actually don't know i think i want to go to the fairy one first because i think fairy is going to be a little well then again fighting I know it's in this area. There's like level 50 plus in here. So we might take a trip over here to see what might be over in this area first and kind of determine from that. Um, but yeah, I think right now, as we have everybody, we have the team, I think, pretty much set for the moment. Uh, as long as we keep Tyke from biting it, uh, we do have Aria, the Cricketune, Fang, the Venomoth, uh, Sigurd, the Pineco, which we just recently got. We need to really do a lot of training. Uh, and Paula, the Shroomish, who is the honorary bug because it is a bug terrestrialized form. We got a couple more bugs that we still need to find. Uh, we still need to find a um, Surskit, and we need to find a Heracross. Heracross, I know where that's going to be. We're going to get Heracross around level 50 or so because it is going to be... Wrong way. It's going to be right in this area. I know there's a lot of level 50s in here, and one of them is going to be Heracross Surskit. I'm not 100% sure. Thinking it's going to be maybe down here in Area 6. I don't 100% know. That doesn't exactly matter. Enough talk. Let's go do something. I'm going to go over here to West Province, and then we will take a little, uh, take a little run over to, I think, the normal gym. The Everyman. Uh, who needs training? Really all of them do. Tyke hasn't been out in a while. The Tyke and Flitter really haven't done a lot for a few episodes. We need to make sure that Tyke is still getting levels. Uh, actually, no. We need to we actually go to Cascafara. We don't want to completely hemorrhage ourselves with levels there and with experience 
Okay. Um, have I been having enough nice battles? Two trainers in the desert. Uh, well, you know, since we're here, let's go find some other trainers to fight. Um, so yeah, we got high jump from the last trainer, not trainer, um, Titan, we did. Uh, and we've had dash and surf, so. So we get our glide and we need our climb. Thankfully, since every since these guys have twenties, this should be pretty easy to uh, get in here and grab those last couple of members before we head out. Yeah, no, it's not very effective, but we're so high level. Um, but yeah, right now just trying to get some experience at this point. I think that everyone in the party kind of has as much. Oh, whoops. That was not exactly where I wanted to go. Um, let's hope levels will take care of things. Yes, it will. Good. Because um, I remember I tried to give some of the guys medicine the last time that we played. So, like, your Carbos, your Iron, and such. Uh, and... 35. That's some good experience. And back attack. Um, and a lot of people couldn't take any of the medicines, which means that they probably have... Oh, nice. Single hit. I love that. Um, probably have about as much... <sighs> getting ambushed everywhere. Uh, EVs as they can. Oh, that was a bad move. It's okay. We're still high enough level. Uh, have as much EVs as they can, so at this point it might just be straight leveling. I might as well hit up these uh, Terra things as well, just in case. That's... Okay. So a grass Pokemon in a grass Terra den. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Get back off from that. Uh, let's go hit up the Watchtower real quick. So we have another Fly Point. Doesn't exactly matter, but... Um, who are you? You are a Sandy Ghast. Okay. Let's see what you got. Are you a bug, Terra? You're probably not, but... No, you're a grass, Terra. Which, honestly, I think that's awful for you. But, neither here nor there. Let's get the experience. And break the tariff. And finish taking you out the rest of the way. It's a Briviary. That's going to be bad if I attack it. There's another Titan. But I don't think we have the stuff ready for him yet. Uh, water Pyroar. You, on the other hand. I need one more person. Is... I'm trying to remember what Dawn Fan is. I think Dawn Fan is ground... It's not ground fighting, is it? Why did I attack it to find out? There's this thing called a Pokedex. I am intelligent. Yeah, that's that's it, Cherry. We always have to take the hard way. That's that's exactly the reason. It wasn't just because I forgot. Uh, Dawn Fan. 
Dawn. Not Diglett. Dawn fan. Straight ground. I don't have water. I don't have grass. Don't have a lot to deal with that. <laughs> Woof. All right. Um, okay. If I don't know. If I don't remember, rather, offhand what the big one is. Because I'm pretty sure the big one's going to be slightly different. Since it's not exactly a uh not exactly a dawn fan it's a version of dawn fan but only kind of okay is there another person out here in the desert that i can fight i don't want to have to climb up something no puts me in the west province okay so most likely there are more people I don't know, maybe they're on the cliffs or something like that. That's fine. I don't... Oh, no, no. Well, there's a person. There's a small kid. As long as we stay away from Dawn Fan. If you... I hate that joke, small child. If you shorten pants, do you get a pan? Come on. Bad. Okay, let's take you out real quick and then immediately leave. Okay, now that that's <laughs> short pants but a long face. Well, don't pick fights with the protagonist. Uh, I think, yeah, we gotta go all the way over to Cascarafa. That's fine. Let's fly over there. Let's get whatever bonus item that, uh, what's face is gonna give me, and then I think we'll go back down to, uh, Porto Mardrina, and we will go up from there. Let's also heal. Ooh, game. Keep it up. Or keep up, rather. Ooh, the frames. The frames. Be too much. All right. Yes. Defeated five. Give me whatever you're going to give me. Earthquake. Earthquake. Excuse me? I apparently need to pay more attention to those, uh, those league options. Um, because I never found Earthquake in my casual play, and boy, howdy, that would have been very useful. Ouch. Let's fight. What are you? Ooh, you're a ghost. Ghost Minecraft. Neat. We are getting very favorable matchups with Tyke being out in front. A little tougher. Person. Our special today is the taste of defeat coming right up. Yeah? Uh, hey, Tauros, back off. Hey, guys, stop it. I... Aina and I are a little busy here. But also, you got, uh, you got words there. You're going to try to gonna try to dish it out, huh? Well... Sorry, I didn't like it. I'm sending it back to the kitchen. Okay. Yeah, we can go through here. Nice big open cave. And I know I said we're not going to fight trainers, but... I want to see what this one has. Also, because all the, like, free stuff that we're getting from... Okay, 24. We're still alright. Uh, the free stuff that we've been getting from those... Battle people as of late. Who? 
That's some good stuff. Earthquake is... That is a massive update. I don't know if anyone can use it, but... Uh, no. You don't need to swap speed with somebody else. Oh, and you're, you are going to learn a bunch of these. No. No. We're not playing that game. You don't need to. Get in here. Mediate. Don't, don't mind me. I just want that. Just want to get some items in here. Don't come at me. I think we'll save a bunch of these trainers that are out here for a... Uh, possibly training some of our other guys in case something terrible happens. Hopefully it won't, but... We know how these things go. Give a churro a shmuo. Uh, I don't think I will, because you don't have anything that's actually going to help uh, bugs. So, no. Okay. Here's Jim. Let's do it. Ah, called it. Hey, Bruno! It's smooch churro, I missed a pun? Okay, well, that's fine. I saw you going into the gym and I came running. Listen, I'm really sorry I couldn't battle you the last time we ran into each other. Wait, don't get me wrong, I didn't chase you down just to battle you. Then again, I guess I wouldn't mind a battle or anything if you wanted to. What do you say? Are you going to actually give me a choice this time? Yeah, I didn't think so. Oh, wait, hold on. I want to be sure to pick the right Pokemon for where you're at in your journey. Sorry, give me a sec to fine-tune my team. Then we can battle. In fact, while you're waiting, go ahead and take on the gym. Ah, uh, okay. So, after. That's fine. Uh... Yeah, we need these two. All right, let's do it. Medali Jim, let me register you as a challenger, Bruno. Excellent. Let's get started. In order to face the gym leader, Larry, you'll first need to pass the gym test. Here at the Medali Jim, that means ordering a special secret menu item. The menu at the Treasure Eatery, a much-loved restaurant here in Medali. Order correctly and you pass. Right now, there are three other challengers around town attempting this gym test. Each challenger has been given a different clue. That'll help them discover the secret dish. You'll be given a clue as well. Please find and battle other challengers. The loser must tell the winner their clue. Your goal is to gather the clues and use them to determine the secret dish, then order it from the waiter at the treasure eatery. Only the challenger who's able to order correctly will pass the test. Your clue is to find out how regulars season their dishes. I suggest you start by hearing what a regular at the treasure eatery has to say. Cool. So let's go find other people, beat them up, take their knowledge. You, you're a challenger. I do have a clue, but you won't learn it. Gisela, oh, what? Hello? Uh, why am I over there? You're trying real hard, game. Oh, okay, and then you're, okay, never mind. That's fine, that's fine. There's a weird way for that to work. Uh, okay, 34, all right, all right, that's, we should be okay. Still five levels ahead. That's fine. Ah, should have used third chop again. Okay. Do you have anyone else? No. Cool. 
I can't believe this gym test makes each makes us steal each other's clues. That's fighting dirty. Not really. All right, so tell me your clues. So you didn't tell me there. A dark spot surrounded by stairs. I don't remember seeing any particularly dark spots in this town. Yeah. You didn't at all. Okay. I wonder what's down here. Hey, look, it's a dark spot. It says Fire Blast. Okay. Super spicy. Alrighty. Anyone back here? Not that's doing the gym challenge, but I do have some people who are doing food. Um, nothing for bug, though, so do not care. Uh, and you still have the same ice cream as everybody else, which means none of them are going to be useful. Okay. Finding coins. Oh, thanks. They weren't mine, but that's okay. I'll take gimme gold coins. I need a whole lot of them if I want to actually uh, evolve a gimme ghoul. I also have to catch a gimme ghoul, though. Um, yeah, nothing. Okay. You! You are a small child in a school uniform. Let's fight. Since you're also taking this gym chest. Adara? I why did you throw it that way? Or why did I suddenly turn that way too? Game, you're you're having a time, aren't you? Okay. Don't like that. But that's also always just guaranteed to be half your health, so. Not as concerned. Okay. Neat. You're level 40 now. Great. Uh, I don't really like Sucker Punch for you because you already have enough speed. Uh, let's go ahead and switch out to someone who's not level 40. I think you're still going to obey me at 40 here, but I'd rather not take that chance. Okay. That does nothing. Let's buzz. That does a lot. Ooh, this could be bad. Oh, but it failed. Why does it fail? Does it have to actually be physically hit, I wonder? Huh. Learning more about Pokemon the more I play it. Too bad, Adara. Nope, can't trade clues. Give to me your clue. Look for something that's odd out of one of the ice cream stands. All right, well, let's go look at every ice cream stand. You're an ice cream stand. You have a seventh option. Grilled rice balls. Okay. Still all the same. Uh, do you... All the crepes are going to be the same, though, too. Give me something I can use. What do you have? You have ice cream. And you have the same as everything else. Okay. So, fire blast, grilled rice balls. We still need to find someone else with a clue. Then we have to go to the treasure eatery. I'm going to come in here real quick. And get some sandwich recipes. Cool. Thank you. Now, since we're at a different sandwich shop, do you have a sandwich that might be useful? 
Um, no. There are no good sandwiches for bugs. Makes me very sad. And I don't know the sandwich ingredients well enough to be able to determine what I would need to do myself for that. Um, you. You look like you have a, a gym test in mind. Yes. Tell me your secret, Santiago. Oh, I see a little kid playing a Wii there. How nice. Oh, this was probably a bad move. Okay, now I've gotten some of my health back because I'm hitting things, but I did forget to heal. Okay, and you're just going to make me tired. That's fine. That is my secret, though, Santiago. I'm always tired. Okay, good. Another challenger down. Yes, you do have to tell me your clue. Tell me your clue. Listen closely to the blue bird Pokemon. I'm still puzzling over that word it said. All that it kept, all that thing kept me from focusing on the battle. All right, blue bird. It's you, Squawkabilly. Okay. Say an actual word, please. No, think. Medium. Okay. So, grilled rice. Uh, you're just ingredients, right? No. Grilled rice balls. Uh, fire blast. Medium. And we need to go talk with the regular. We need to go find a regular. But first... We need to heal our Pokemon, lest I forget. We're also going to switch out to have Flitter do some work. Flitter hasn't done a lot yet. Uh, this is a big place, so I'm thinking this is the treasure eatery. Yes, the famed treasure eatery. Hooray! Um, uh, cool. Let's talk to people. I hear it said that there's some kind of amazing gimmick at the treasure eatery. I bet there is. Huh? A secret menu item? Sorry, I don't know anything about that. Hey, you! Person! Hmm? Oh, yeah, I, I suppose I do come here often. You must be a gym test challenger. Here's a tip for you. A nice squeeze of lemon gives any dish a refreshing kick. Neat! Let's... Order something then. Order the secret menu item. Okay. Where's all the keywords? Grilled rice balls. A medium serving. Extra crispy. Fly fire blast style. And a little lemon. Medium serving grilled rice balls, fire blast style with fresh lemon on the side. Medium rice balls, extra medium rice balls, extra crispy with lemon coming right up. And by that I mean, we're going to yeet everyone out of this stadium <laughs> and put in a gym floor. Where do all those people go? Like, do they just get, I wonder how, like, do they get a chance to actually leave or does it just like open up and I want, like, maybe everyone's just underneath right now. Like the floor just dropped and then this one just came over top of it. They're all just eating in the dark. Oh God, not again. Uh, 
They're up there doing that darn poke battling again. What's with all these weird kids these days? Let's go through, see if we can get... Okay, so Prometheus can get a couple more things. Uh, we need sword by type. So it's up at the top. All right. Uh, we don't have any move in particular that we want for power points up. Oh, we have three rare candies. Okay. Uh, eh, let's not do all that quite yet. All right, cool. Well, let's fight. The exceptional everyman himself, Gym Leader Larry. Yes, I do indeed. Larry, you're up. Oh, it's that very obvious looking guy who's different from everyone else. He also looked very done with life. Hello. I'm Larry. I'm assigned to work as the gym leader of the Med Medali Gym. Good job on making your way through the gym test. And well, maybe try the other dishes on the menu too sometime. Everything's good here. Anyway, my boss will dock my pay if I spend too much time chit-chatting. Let's get this battle over with. Yeah, Cherry, sure, you're right. Dinner time's over. Get out. Ah, uh, Larry. Thank you for doing business with us today. I, Larry, will be at your service. Thanks, Larry. Oh, that's a that's a throw, my guy. It's a good throw. I love how you just, like, stand at attention. I just ate, so let's not go too hard. I think we can all agree Larry is 100% the best gym leader so far. He's so relatable. Alright, one down. Though I am also now asleep. Yeah, sleep's not great. Um, You're about to send out Dadun Sparse? Such a stupid Pokemon. Uh, do we have anyone with actually fighting moves anymore? We do, we have Shelob. It's the Dunsparce. You're large. Uh, let's go ahead and wake you up. Uh, where's Awakening? Oh, that's not good. Let's Terra. Let's... Um, let's not tear it just yet. Let's go ahead and do a draining kiss. Oh, that didn't do anything. Okay, well, can't do that. I don't like glare. It's rude. Okay. Can we put you to sleep? Okay. Uh, do we have a max potion? We don't have a full restore, though. Hmm. Okay. Um. Yeah, just let's just do the hyper. Let's let's get you back up to full. Don't need you dying on me, Flitter. Okay. Let's do bug buzz. Okay. All right, we need to we need to swap out for someone who is a little more a little tankier. Sheila. Also because you have a fighting move, frankly. OK. 
Okay, that didn't do nearly as much, which is good. Um, so yeah, let's do counter, assuming that you're... And of course, you call me a liar. That's not great, but all right. Um, okay. I'm going to take this time, actually, to heal people. Yeah, let's just go ahead and heal you. Okay, not very effective there. However, don't want you to do hyper drill and then take me out, so. Don't glare. Come on, enough of that. Okay. It's fine, we're gonna just work through that. You still only have bug bite, I see. Okay, not very effective, which is fine. Let's see, we want a critical hit. Okay, good. Let's just keep doing this then. Could you? No, I'm not going to say could you stop because you can't stop. It is literally your job to fight me. Okay, one done, sparse done. Uh, X scissor. There we go. There is the f bug move we're looking for. Huh. Okay. Good. A staraptor. Yeah, I'm gonna have to switch. Um. Actually, you're the one with rock, though. So. But you're going to immediately transform into uh, Yeah, we're going to go Prometheus. Because you're going to transform into normal type. Which that's fine. However, you are still a very big bird. That's not great. This is still better than getting cornered by my boss. Okay. Definitely terastalize. And, uh... Let's go for it. You're pretty good. I might end up losing this. Come on, Larry. Step it up a notch. We've got hungry customers waiting. Give them something to cheer for, you hear? Now they've all come back. Show us what you got, Larry. And you too, kid. Well, you heard the good folks. I suppose I can put on a bit more of a show. Hmm. Okay, now that Prometheus is just straight fire type, hopefully it won't just get annihilated by this. It pretty much did. But we got a burn, so that's a plus. Now hopefully this will do some pretty solid damage. Not really. Okay. In that case... I'm going to go ahead and, uh, because that, I can't, ooh, and everyone's a bug. That's what I was, that's what I was afraid of. Okay, um, we'll go with Mantis, because as much as I like having the 
fiery one out. We need something that can survive flying moves. And Mantis may be able to do it. I think it's time to show you that real life isn't just being true to yourself. Oh, and that's going to do extra damage. Ooh, that's not great. Well... It's a good thing I have a lot of potions. Because if that's going to do one, if that's going to take me that far down with just one hit. Yep. I don't know if I'm faster than you, and I don't think I want to try to play that. So uh, we might, we might just have to cheese a little bit here. I would like to not have people lose lives if I don't require them to lose lives. Yeah, because that's a lot. I don't quite think... I don't trust myself to have enough... Uh, now I have to use the hypers. Because you can do almost 100 to me in one shot. Don't quite trust my guys to... Uh, be faster here. Hmm. The safe move is to heal again. The hero move is to try it. Come on, Mantis. Be beautiful for me, baby. Oh, exactly what I wanted. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Mantis. Didn't expect you to be that fast, but I'm happy you were. All right. Cool. <sighs> you certainly threw me for a loop. You're rather strong, aren't you? Even enough to bring up my poker face, even. I lost, so that means I have to give you a badge, but... A battle made me a bit hungry. Care to join me for a meal? Sure! I like food. You really enjoy rice balls. Having five gym badges in hand makes it easier to catch Pokemon up to level 45. Oh, and they'll actually listen to you, too. This is for you. Though hopefully a child like you has no need to put it, put on its namesake. Huh, <laughs> facade. Ha, uh, 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 Larry, are you okay, bud? You don't sound okay. The dishes here. They've all got flavor. Good flavor, I mean. Oh, don't worry about the bill. I do earn a salary, after all. I better get back to work. If you'll excuse me. Bye, Larry. Another gym leader defeated. Well done. Rika informed me that there was an unusual trainer worth keeping an eye on. It seems she meant you. <laughs> I'd guessed as much. I had the pleasure of observing your last match. I was impressed by the fantastic skill you showed. If you manage to keep your momentum and achieve champion rank, I will be very interested in inviting you to the Pokemon League and... Hey, hey, Bruno! I've got my team all picked out! And I saw you battling the gym leader. You just keep getting better. Uh, is level limit only for Pokemon you catch above your badge level? No. So, if I were to have one of my guys come in at, like, 50 right now, there would be still a good chance that they wouldn't listen to me. Uh, even if I've had them since, you know, day one. Um, that is just overall... Uh, 
as far as how the badges normally work, even if it's someone that has been with you. Um, if they get over a certain level and just over level, then they won't listen to you either. That's why they try to keep pushing you to go do gyms. Kind of like uh, Ash's Charizard in the anime. He doesn't listen to him for quite a while. <laughs> How good to see you again, Champion Nimona. It certainly has been a while. Whoa, wait. La Primera? With Bruno? It... Why do you call it that? Wait, did I forget to give you the full explanation? Everyone calls Miss Greta La Primera because she's just that. She's the real number one, even higher than us regular champions. She's the top champion. I do indeed hold that claim. Alongside my role as chairwoman of the Pokemon League, that is. I, I thought you were too busy to spend your time checking in on gyms. I'm not here to inspect the gym. I've come to scout some rather promising young talent. Whoa! I look away for one second and you're famous, Bruno? But hey, I found Bruno first. You may be La Primera, but you can't go stealing him from me. <laughs> I suppose I'll have to get in line. That's right. Come on, Bruno. Time for our battle. Quick, let's go! The battlefield's calling! One moment, please. Huh? What is it? I would very much like to observe this match, if that is all right. Ooh, <laughs> totally fine by me. Sounds fun, right, Bruno? Uh, sure. You're not going to give me a chance to really speak either way, so. Uh, thank you kindly. I'm already excited to see you two face off. Let's be on our way, then. Uh, if you're looking for a new challenge, someone do a Do the Gym's Last challenge. That would be good. Uh, I do know that we had someone in the chat the other day who was saying they were doing a Professor Oak challenge, which is also pretty insane. Um, as far as you can't do a gym until you've collected every Pokemon possible from each area. So you're collecting probably about 70 to 80% of the Pokedex before you get, like, to the first gym. That's including all the Evolve forms, too. So, boy howdy, that's going to be a lot of Pokemon not listening to you. You remember how it all works, right? Once you get badges from all the gyms, you get to throw down against the strongest Pokemon trainers around. Yes, you must face the Pokemon League. It is located to the northwest of Mezagoza. The Pokemon League is where the trainers are reborn as champions. It's the greatest honor they might dream of. Collecting eight gym badges sets up to take the champion assessment. If you can face the challenge of the final examiner and win, you'll become a champion. Just imagine how that moment would feel. Try getting into that champion mindset. Now, set your sights on reaching that big important stage, and let's battle... Uh, excuse me, one moment. I believe Bruno's Pokemon may still be a little fatigued. <laughs> Sorry, I got a little caught up in my battle hunger. <sighs> well, you should be all in good shape now, thanks to La Primera. Okay, Bruno, time to put our game faces back on. Let's have us another fruitful battle. Yeah, all right. All right, Nimona, let's do this. What do you got this time? Great. <laughs> Double great. Ugh. Am I fast enough that I can just put you to sleep? No. There goes Flitter. Okay. That's a good start. That's a very, very good start. Okay, cool. Well, crap. Uh, yeah, let's do Sheila. Let's counter. Okay, good.
Yeah, do it again. Come on. Good. I mean, not good that we lost someone, but, you know, them's the breaks. About to send out Gumi. Sure, let's switch. So that way we can keep cycling people through and not have them all just immediately perish. Uh, about to send out Pomo. Eh, we're okay. Because we're high enough level that Tyke didn't even get touched. Uh, okay, nothing's very effective, so we'll try to use Lunge for same type. Okay, halfway. I could take that. Well, isn't that just mean of you? Why do you gotta be like that? Goodbye, Palmo. Okay, now you have your starter last. Which, are you fully evolved by this point? I'm assuming you are. Yeah. Miascarada, so, yes. Prometheus. Avenge your fallen brethren. Haha, <laughs> wow. You seeing this, Primera? I'm getting backed right into a corner. Look at that smug look on your face. Time to terastalize. Watch, I'm gonna make La Primera's eyes light up. Yep, you'll do it first and I'll do it better. I suppose this was kind of lucky on my part. I didn't think about this. Because I definitely started this before I decided to do the challenge. So I definitely picked uh, Fue Coco. Because Head Empty Boy is best boy. Which means that the anchor Pokemon for the rival is always going to be at a disadvantage. Didn't exactly think about that, but hey. At least I didn't make it harder on myself, right? Any harder than I already have. Well, not quite a one-shot. Oof, that was a good one. Your move really had some zing to it. Uh, you did 40. Okay, I think we should be all right. Okay, I'm pulling out all the stops. Get ready. I want you to stand up to this. I should be able to. Oh, I'm not. Woof. All right, finished up, Mantis. Mm. That's not great. People are going to start paying more attention to you. I just know it. An amazing display of talent, even against one such a skilled as champion Nimona. That was a splendid match. I enjoyed watching very much. Now even La Primera thinks you're one to watch. You've got so much potential. The way you're going, I'd better watch my back. 
You know, since the first time we met, I've been weirdly sure of one thing. You're going to become a champion. No doubt about it, Bruno. The rest of these gems, you can take them. 100%. No problem. I agree. In fact, you should take this. Consider it an investment in your future. Ooh, Terra Blast. If a Pokemon uses that move while terrestrialized, the move's type will change to the Terra type of the Pokemon. One day, Bruno, you and me are going to have the greatest battle of all. I know it. I'm going to go train up even more than I already have been. She shows you she shows you such support and friendship. Or perhaps perhaps she hopes you might truly rival her? Hmm? <laughs> no, I I think it's no mere hope. She seems to have complete faith that you will catch up to her. At any rate, allow me to return you to the gym where I found you. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. We have now an entire team of Death Store. Well, and that's just half the team that is currently in the party, because Fang here is also on one life. Which is not great news. Arya still has two, and of course we haven't done anything with Sigurd or technically Paula. But, boy howdy, trying to use Paula right now seems bad. I think what we're going to do... Flitter... Um, actually, I'm just going to take that back. You're going to switch out for Aria. Aria. Oh, Aria is so low. Oh, Aria is so low. I don't want to train. Training is going to be rough. Okay. Um, and Sigurd. Take Mantis for now. Okay. We'll have Arya and Sigurd to soak up a bit of experience here. Should probably put Paula in too. I mean, taking out Prometheus, which, let's do that. Because I don't exactly want to use Tyke, but. Tyke is kind of the one that we need to use. Because Tyke does have the best chance, I think, out of everyone that we have currently against what's probably going to be the next gym is our psychic one. Yeah. Let's go back to Cortando. Let's oh, Well, if I haven't battled you yet, you probably aren't too high a level since you're back here at like gym 1, so yeah, let's see if Paula can get some experience since she's the honorary bug. Okay, that was better than I expected, actually. Okay, good.
small of down, level up. So, Sigurd. Let's get you some work. You don't have a lot of moves to actually do any damage. You get real detailed there, uh, Pineco. I didn't realize how detailed you can get. Okay, but... Okay. Yes, let's fight. Anything to help start training the other members of the team. All right, one more, Sigurd. You got this. Shake off that confusion. Or just work through it. Man, three for three on working off that confusion. You can't be stopped. I would love it if you got out of confusion now. That'd be great. Thank you. Wonderful. Let's keep it going. There's a cave over here. This is somewhat taking the corridor where I want to go next. What's in this cave? This is a cave that I can walk through. Good. Normal types. No, actually. Yeah, Paula. Go after him. You have a fist somewhere in there that you can use to punch. Go punch. Actually, yes. Because they're ground type. Oh, I don't know why you just yeed me over to the other side here, but... That's fine. Okay, Magical Leaf didn't do as much as I would hope, so let's put you... Yeah, let's fight. Is this for me? What do you mean, is this for me? No, I did not order a pizza to be delivered out here. I just started walking up, my dude. Sorry to say, I think you got pranked. Yeah, no, just pass her by. That's fine. Hmm. I also realized that I do not have anything set up for Paula because I wasn't expecting to use her for a while. So, okay. The team's going to look a little weird for a little bit. It's fine. Don't even worry about it. Focus on trainers. And getting to the next town. Ooh, what's down here? I see a cave. A cave of infinite wonder. With slightly stronger than expected Pokemon. Okay, you're a little higher than I'd like, so I'm just going to kind of... Nope, we're going to kind of run around, then we outie. You have your cave. Don't don't even worry about us. We will we'll leave you alone. Which, with that in mind... Uh, if you're going to be that level... Put Sheila about front. Because this probably means that you guys are going to be a little tougher. Yeah, my backpacker roll. 
Pow. Okay. Okay, and you got Go-Go. All right. What level is your Go-Go? 38. Okay. Exactly what I was expecting. Okay. Yeah, Paul's going to get a lot of experience from this. So is Sigurd, actually, but... Pow, it's okay. Just keep following this little worn path here. You know, just to make everything exceptionally dangerous for everybody. But it'll be alright. Just keep following this path. And you will eventually reach the city. Also, really? This is the path they want little 10-year-old kids to walk? This? I mean, I get that it's wide enough, but you slip and fall, like... You ain't coming back from that. I want to get a selfie of me beating you with this gorgeous view as a backdrop. Nope. You ain't gonna beat me, my friend. I'm sorry, Alan. Volton the loser. Too bad I'm a bug type. Because you're part psychic. Which means I'm super... I don't want to do this. Try the counter. Ah, nope. Thought you'd be able to survive, but apparently not. Okay, um... Let's do Sisypha then. Okay. Right. Four deaths. Oh, that's not great. I forgot you have a new move in this game. Hmm. Okay. You'll be fine, Mr. Black Belt. Yes, you've had another defeat, but you'll make it. But uh, circle throw. And the wild ends the battle, a different Pokemon is dragged out. No, I don't really want that because it's not quite as good. It has a limited number of power, or not a limited number of power, but it has a actual number to its power right now. And we don't particularly care about that. That's why we have counter instead, just to do double whatever was taken. Oh, nice. Paul is already going to evolve. Cool. And now we have the Breloom. Breloom, the mushroom grass Pokemon. It scatters poisonous spores and throws powerful punches while its foe is hampered by inhaled spores. Yeesh. That. Okay. Sigurd wants to learn payback. Well, sure, because you're slow. Um, you don't have a good one to get rid of. I'll do spikes, I think. I don't think we're normally going to be leading with Sigurd. We might, though. So maybe I give you that at some point. Oh, and marvelous. Sigurd is evolving as well. Fantastic. Fuck. 
Fortress, Sebagwim Pokemon, is usually found hanging onto a fat tree trunk. It shoots out bits of its shell when it sees action. Terrifying. All right. Now Sigurd has been updated too. Fantastic. No. All right. Cool. Well. Yeah, I think it's time that we need to... We need to get on out of here. We need to get out of this cave. We need to get to Alfornada. Ah, ah, back away, little gremlin. Nope. All this land is our black. I'm not going to fight you just yet, kid. I'm real busy here. I think I have to go up. If I want to get out of here. So, go up. We get some of these other prizes here. All right, cool. Alfornada. Fantastic. Time to heal up. <laughs> okay. Well, uh... So, you know, we at least got through another gym leader, which was good. Then Nimona came along, and we were then very sad. Um... But we didn't completely lose anyone. Uh, I need seven. All right, so I need to go get a couple more. Okay, that's fine. Um... Yeah, and then we got both Breloom, uh, we got Paula, and Sigurd, both evolved. So, we've done some, we've done some work today. We've done some work today. Um, where do I need to go back to? I need to go back here to Court, no. Yes, I already got that one there. Um, I'm going to go back to Medali, actually. See if I manage to get enough uh, enough trainers on the way up. If I can get the free thing there. I don't think so. Um, but yeah, cool. So we made it back to the next town. And, you know, we survived. Wasn't great, but we survived. It's on the other side here. Uh, I think next time, mostly due to necessity... We're going to need to have some more, uh, we're going to need to do another training session. Because we need to get Sigurd and Paula uh, a bit more experience. Oh, I haven't defeated anyone because you're over in that specific area. Okay. Um, yeah, we need to get some more experience for these two. And get them leveled up because they're pretty far behind. Um... How did I take... What route did I take up here? Went through that. So I'm going to go back here to... Uh, actually, no. We'll go back to the hollow here. Because this is where we... Left a bunch of trainers. So, cool. Uh, yeah. So we will get back here next time. We will keep training some of our newbies here. Um... One of our oldies but goodies, you know. Arya's been here for a little while, but she was kind of put to the side for a little bit uh, in order that we could train some of our some of the other people here. Um, I am, since I'm thinking about it, let's go ahead. That is not what I wanted. I did not want the online thing. That's that's fine. Want to go into the box? Let's pull Prometheus back out real quick. Um, because I do want to pour some stats into you. Good, Bug Buzz. It'll be useful. Uh, it's not really useful right now, but More useful than flame charge, so we'll do that. Because at this point, with how much time we've already put into Prometheus, we want we want the final version of him. We want 
Volcarona. May only have one life. But it will still be quite powerful. So, all right. Thank you all for joining us once again here today, everyone. Um, all right, we got another gym under our belt. Unfortunately, that's only up to 45. So, Tyke, Sisava, and Sheila are already creeping up there to where they're not going to behave. Uh, so, we'll just need to work with them and then go after the next gym. Uh, yeah, Paul, Sigurd, and Arya, though. They're well within their ways to behave with us. So, we'll do some training next time. We'll get everyone leveled up. I will get Paula an actual icon. So, she'll be on stream here as opposed to not. Um, yeah, hopefully next time we will we'll do some more good work. Until next time, friends, thank you for joining me. And just as a, uh, just to let you all know, you know, I appreciate you being here. I'm proud of you all. I love you all. Keep being awesome. Keep doing what you do. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye!